Yes, we got him! Get fisted! Uh, uh, uh. Oh, why don't you have any eyeballs? What's up, Monkey Tribe? Thank you for joining me in another episode of Ark Survival Evolved here on the Madagascar Monkey server. It's a beautiful morning. I gotta catch you guys up on a couple of things uh, that have been going on since the last episode. Um, I went ahead and leveled up a few more times and put some more points into health here. And I saved up actually all of our Ingram points so that I could um, show you what we're gonna learn here. Uh, when you get to a certain level here, you have to choose, um, I guess they would be comparable to classes in other games. Um, each class, I guess you could say, is 600 Ingram points. So we have to pick if we want to be like a carpenter or if we want to be a farmer, blacksmith, mason, tailor. And we have the Ingram points increased on this map to the point where... I think we might be able to get almost all of these by the time we reach maximum level, but right now we only have the Ingram points for one. And if you, ha if any of you had watched my Moon series, you know how fond I am of being a farmer. So that's the one that we're going to be choosing. And it says, a new farmer is rough going, gain more experience to learn new methods and crops. So we're going to learn Apprentice Farmer, and then I don't think we can learn anything related to farming until level 45 and we're level 36 now so we got nine more levels to go before we can really do anything with farming but I just wanted to show you guys that that's the class that we're picking for now and then we'll do once we level up a little bit we'll do some um, secondary classes and things later um, the other order of business is that we went adventuring with um, Somac and Mundane off camera and we came across um, some salt mines, and I went ahead and got a couple pieces of salt here. Uh, and I'm not sure what we can use these for yet. It sees, it sees, it says, salty. No, really? Salt is salty? Eat it or season your meals with it to get your electrolytes up. Mix it with sulfur to obtain preserving salt. Well, we haven't found any sulfur yet. I looked around on the mountain where I found the salt, which was... Um, over yonder. It's next to um, Mundane and Somax base, but like up the hill a little ways. Um, the other order of business is we need to figure out how to make some Trank Arrows because I want to tame or try or attempt to tame a Parasaur in this episode. Um, so let's see. If we go into our craftables here, I'm well, hold on. I'm guessing you're going to be able to you make it at the workbench, since that's where you make regular arrows at. Uh, weapons, ammo. We got copper, bone, poison. Okay, this is a pulmonar scorpius, a poisoned arrow that drains health. That's not what... Well, it says it drains health and increases torpor. This says it just drains stamina and health, and this says it drains stamina. So the only one that actually increases torpor is this Pulmonoscorpius arrow. And we're going to need regular wooden arrows. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Does it say that it takes 15 regular arrows or 15 wood arrows to make one poison arrow? And then a Pulmonoscorpius stinger? Oh my gosh. Why would it take 15? Maybe it makes 15? I'm hoping to gosh it makes 15. Um... Let's see, is there any alternatives? We could we could just bowl a, I think you can bowl a Parasaurs. We could just bowl a the Parasaur and then maybe club it unconscious or punch it unconscious. That would probably be a lot cheaper, wouldn't it? Hmm. Yeah. Okay, well I'm gonna wait for this heat uh, shenanigans to go away and then I'll bring you guys back when we're ready to try and take out a Parasaur. And we're back! We're on the hunt for a Parasaur now. I think it's getting... well, oh no, I'm getting heat stroke now. 2%. Is it going up quickly? Let's see. Hmm... nope, it's staying at about 2%. So I think we're good to venture out now. Um, oh gosh, I didn't bring any food with me. I am ill-prepared for this mission. Ooh, there's a trike. That's a little bit out of our league. There's a Pego. <gasps> I wonder if we could tame a Pego. All we need is berries. If it's anything like the pegos on 
other, well, not mods, um, it'll just eat berries from you. Hmm. I'm conflicted. Do we want a pego? Let's go for a parasaur first, because I really want, like, a pack mule that I can just take and gather, like, a whole bunch of stuff with. And it'll give me something fast to ride around and explore the area as well. Um, so I guess I'll, I'll just, um, I'll be looking around here a little bit, and I'll bring you guys back when we find a pair somewhere. Oh, and just so you guys know, I am in the same area as where we found the um, amazing red turtle that I showed you guys in the previous episode. And I didn't forget. I remembered. But I went back to where I thought it was in this area. I thought it was stuck, like, on one of these trees here. Like, this tree right here. I'm pretty sure it was stuck right here. You are stuck in the tree. Look at this nice reddish colored turtle. Can I stick berries in your butt? No. <gasps> Look at him. He's so cool. I want you in my life. You just stay there. And when I get arrows, I'm going to come back for you just because you're an amazing color. But it's not there anymore. But I didn't forget. So if you guys voted on that poll, I did not forget. I didn't look at the results of the poll in the previous episode yet, but I did my best, and it's just not there. Oh no! We've been robbed, you stupid little thing! No, he's mate boosted! That means they're gonna get more stealers! No! Give me my... What did you even steal from me? My torch! Give me my torch back, you jerk! How many hits are you gonna take? Get some! Oh no, he's gonna steal some reels from me! Coming back for seconds! No, my hide shirt! Ah! Yes, take that! Give me my stuff, you jerk face! I hate these things. He stole my bone needle. What do you even have use for a bone needle for? Huh? Ooh, why is your face not rendered? Gross. I'm gonna get rid of it. Goodbye, face. Hello, Dodo. Oh, a 145 female Dodo? Ooh, I wonder how long that would take. Uh... No. Don't get distracted, monkey. You're on a mission. Oh, there he is, you guys. Victory is ours! Okay. He's gonna pre prepare to meet our fists of fury, Parasaur. Okay, is there anything that can kill us in the area? Let's see, let's do some recon. Let's see, we got, oh, I thought that was something down there. We got turtles, we got dodos, we got, huh. I think that's about it. I think we're good to go. Yes, okay, what level are you gonna be? I'm kinda hoping like less than or equal to 50? Yes, 20. Oh, oh no! I scared it, I spooked it. No, don't go in the water, please. Come back out. Okay, I didn't know that they got spooked. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. We're gonna try and run him into the wall here. Let's get on the left side of him. Okay, go into the wall. Go into the wall. That would be, no, 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 no. Don't go up the hill. Oh, there's another parasaur. Should we see what level that one is? Or go for this one? Oh, this one stopped. Let's just go for this one. Oh! Yes, we got him! Get Fisted! Uh, uh, uh. Oh, why don't you have any eyeballs? <laughs> uh, are you getting sleepy? I wonder how many times I'll have to punch him. Don't die on me, though. Oh, no, he's getting all bloody. Let's just punch him in the butt. Getting tired? Huh? Oh, no, we're gonna kill him. Get sleeping! Yes! We did it! Unconscious! Okay. Oh no, we can't access this inventory. Can we not tame parasaurs? It doesn't look like we can tame parasaurs. Dang it! Ugh. Okay, we're just gonna use you for your meats then. At least I didn't waste anything important like trank arrows. Alright, let's just take some of his meats. So we can take it back to base then. Alright, are they a passive tame, do you think? 
Or do we need something special? Let's look if there's like Parasaur special something somethings. I don't see any special something somethings in here. Para. There's a saddle. Equip a Parasaur with this to ride it. I wonder if we just need to maybe put a saddle on it and then it tames it automatically? Hmm. Okay, we know there was another Parasaur in this area. So let's get back to base and craft a saddle and then go find a Parasaur and see if um, it lets us like equip a saddle to tame it instead of trying to knock something out. All right, we're rolling back up on base here. We got a couple levels on the way back from fighting some Dillos. So let's see, what's the next stat do we really want to pump? Um, we might do health till 200. Or melee damage. Yeah, let's do some melee damage. That sounds good. Um, and we can't really learn anything till level 45 anymore. So I guess we're good. Um, we need to get back here and repair our... Um, hide as well oh yes more poop to play poop roulette with let's see what we get boom okay we got a couple stacks of meat that we can start oh no where's our fire okay we don't have a fire anymore what do we need to make fire wood uh if i was wood where would i be haha <laughs> get it i made a joke and i didn't even mean to if i was wood wood where would i be Okay, I'm gonna stop trying to be funny now. Okay, campfire. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about, baby. Get some more melee damage going on. Place that here. No, why did I just hit it? I'm a retard. Okay. There, and there, and there, and boom. We don't have a fire maker for it. Okay, what do we need for a fire making kit? Flint. We got flint. Let's just go ahead and make five of these suckers. Oh yeah, I remember. I used all of them on our adventure that I was talking about earlier. What do we get in poop roulette? Oh yeah, worms. We love our worms. Start that fire going. And what do we need to repair our hide? Mm -hmm. We need hide strips and plant strings, which I think I have in here. Hide strips. And we'll use this fiber to make some plant strings. Uh, let's just make all 16 of them. And then we can repair all of our armor at once. Even though it's not fully destroyed, but let's get naked anyways. Repair. Repair. Oh, we're probably going to need some more hide strips. I think I have extras. Do I not? I swore I had extras. Did I put them in there? Here we go. And what are we going to need for a Parasaur saddle? Okay, we need... Oh my gosh, we need leather? How do we make leather? Okay, this is going to be more in-depth than I thought. Okay, in order to make leather, I think we need a special building. Hmm. If we just search leather, will it show up? No. Okay, let's just finish doing this real quick. Boom and boom. Okay, now in order to make leather, we're going to need, I think it's called a tanning rack. Tanning rack. Dry and tan hide to harden it into leather. So I need 15 wood. Oh man, I might have lucked out. I think we need salt to do this. And I just got that salt. Okay, I don't have any more wood. We only need 15 though, and then we should be good. Should be good with the wood. Okay, I'll stop now. Tanning. Okay, a little bit more wood. Ta-da! Okay, and then the salt, I think, goes in with the hide. And then you got to leave it in there for a certain amount of time. And then it goes and turns into 
leather. I'm not sure how much it does at a time though. Or how long it takes. So this will be interesting. Just place it outside like that. Okay. Hang, hide to dry, and salt. Yep, hide and salt. So we got 48 hide. And I think, did I put the salt on you? <gasps> More poop! I get so excited about poop in this game, it's ridiculous. Uh, salt. Okay. Hopefully that gives us at least 21 hide for 21. Or 21 leather, I mean, for 21 salt. Harden it into leather. Okay, so I'm going to let that do its thing. And um, I guess while it's doing its thing, I'm going to go collect up some more resources so we can stockpile some. And then I'll bring you guys back um, when we have some leather. And we're back! Literally two hours later. That's right, you guys. I didn't... The 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 because words salt that I had in there um only made like I don't know twenty leather like I said yeah twenty leather but we needed sixty for the saddle so I had to go on a massive salt hunt and I went like all the way around the map and I got killed by raptors and I went. I got my stuff back and then I would go somewhere else and I got killed by more raptors and then I finally found the salt, finally got back, and now we have, boom, 50, 84 leather to mess around with. Let's take some of this leather out so, or I mean hide out so it doesn't get turned into uh, leather because we need to make some hide strips in order to make the saddle that we want. Um, let's see, we're going to need 60 hide strips, okay, so I have... Do I have extra hide strips in you, the dodo? <laughs> I do not. So I'll have to make a few more hide strips. Let's see. Stir rips. Boom. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Oh no, my bone knife broke. Okay. We'll make another bone knife. What do we need for a bone knife? Should be good, right? Wood. We need a wood. Okay. Oh wait, did it say we needed sharpened bone? I think I got sharpened bone in here. Yep, okay, one sharpened bone. Now, I, while we were waiting for the leather to craft up, I went and did some wood chopping, as you can see here. So we got, we're good in the wood department for now. So we shouldn't have a problem if anything needs, like, any sort of wood or any crude planks or anything. We should be good to go. Let's craft another bone knife so we can get some more... Do we need more strips, or is that enough strips, actually? Put that in there. Saddles. Okay, we have enough hide strips. We need ten plant strings. There's... How, do I have plant strings in you? No. So we need... Oh! Also, the amazing thing, when I was out um, exploring, I found, like, a bunch of stuff. I found wet clay balls. I found lemon seeds, cotton seeds, grape seeds, and this hide tent and hide sleeping bag in a drop. And the drops are super cool on this. Um, they aren't like beacons of light in the sky like all the other maps. They actually, like, I wandered upon what looked like, like another player's tent or a, like another player's hut with a fire outside. And it's actually like a prefabricated building that actually acts as the drop. And it looks like a house, and you go up to the campfire and access the campfire inventory, and it says, um, drop, and it's got a whole bunch of goodies in there. And then I took the goodies, and it, like, demolishes the house like a regular drop. Um, so it's kind of cool. You can't see the drops, but when you wander across them, it, it's pretty cool. So at some point, I kind of want to go exploring and just, like, looking for drops, because I don't know what other sorts of goodies you can get in them. Um, I also got a cloth hat from a raptor. Which you can't even craft in Survival Plus, so I'm hanging on to that. That's like a, a collector's item now. I'm going to trade that for something good. Uh, let's get some fiber out of here and craft up a couple more hide strings. Uh, plant strings, I said. Boom, boom, boom. That should be enough. And then we'll go get 60 leather out of here. 50, 5... 10, and then what else? We just needed a couple more wood, I think. Uh, do we run out of slots? Okay, take this out for now, this out for now. Uh, bone knife goes in our crafting section. 
We'll get 15 wood. Let's just stick 60 in there just because. Mm, we'll take this wood ash out. You put your wood ash in. You put your wood ash out. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And you craft your parasaur saddle thing. And that's what it's all about. Let's take the crude chest and put plant strings in. Parasaur saddle. Yes, we did it. I hope we get all the XPs for this. Now I put this back in and this back in. Take this back out. This in. Oh yeah, baby. It's pump melee damage. Oh, we're level 45 now. We can make our special things. Look, journeyman farmer things. Re gain more experience to learn new methods of crops. I did that. Okay, wait. Journeyman farmer, apprentice farmer. Okay. Now we're a journeyman farmer, but where do we make our farming things? Are they in here? Are they in our work table? If I was a- f oh, farming! Here we go, seeds. Oh wait. No. That's not a special farmer thing. Structures? Wood? Special farmer things? No. If I was a special far- I am a special farmer, where- oh here! Rake. Used to rake small fields. Okay, so I guess like just random ingrams show up inside of here. Like this paper bag. Amazing. Sheet of paper. Okay, so we're gonna have to play around with all of our farmer stuff in the next episode. Um, but let's go see if we can tame a parasaur now. Let's see what the saddle... Does the saddle say anything? I didn't even grab the saddle. I'm a retard. Okay, we'll grab the saddle out. <laughs> it says equip a parasaur with this to ride it. So I'm gonna go find a parasaur to equip and ride it then. There was one down yonder. So I'll bring you guys back when I find it again. Oh, there's two of them. Okay, let's see which one's the better level. I'm gonna guess that I have to put this in my last slot inventory. If I can even do that. Can I? No, I can't even do that. Okay, this might be bad. This is a bad sign. That I can't put the saddle anywhere. Maybe if it's just in my inventory, it'll still work. Hey, can I equip you? Okay. That doesn't work even a little. How about you? Are you gonna want to be equipped with the saddle? <gasps> Raptor alert! Raptor alert! <laughs> okay. This is tricky. We have our saddle. We tried knocking it out and we couldn't access the inventory. And we tried equipping it without knocking it out. So I don't really know what else to try. Um, I'm going to do some research on it because I, th I think I've done all that my brain can think of and then I'll be right back. Okay, you guys, new plan. We are going to find a parasaur nest. I guess that dinosaurs, or there's like a random chance for nests to appear on the map, and then you can like steal fertilized parasaur eggs from those nests. So I'm going to go around and look for one of those, and then we'll be able to basically um, hatch ourselves a parasaur. And then, once it's a uh, grown adult parasaur, then we should be able to equip the saddle? I think that's how it works. Actually, just kidding. Um, I was on with Somac earlier, and he said that he had some parasaur eggs ready to hatch. So, if he has more than one over there, I'm gonna just, you know, borrow it. Incubating! Amazing. Okay. How long is this going to take? We did it! Level 50 Parasaur! Oh, you're so cute! Here, have some food. Okay. Uh, disable wandering. You're so adorable! Oh my gosh! If there wasn't a big bad Parasaur, or not a big bad trike outside, I would take you out there. How much can food can you hold? Oh, look at this! His weight's already... Okay, so it's not like Vanilla Arc where it's got to, um, 
wait to eat or wait till it has weight wait till it has weight does that make sense only in this game we did it you guys we got ourselves a pap meal i can't believe it i'm actually it's actually the next day in real life i had to leave this gal overnight to um grow up because it was getting a little bit too late oh look at these cool green color let's uh get rid of our hood and see what you look like oh yeah baby he kind of looks like a um spino if you just look like right there with like the spikes on the back or the fin whoa we need to give this gal a name now that we have like a little bit of a base going on where we could kind of protect our dinos now we should probably end up giving it's a her, right? Her a name, yeah. Um, I'll have to think of one. Now, how about you guys think of one? If you guys think of a, a, a good name for a female parasaur, let me know in the comment section below. And if uh, I get a one that I want, I will go ahead and name her in the next episode. Um, let's go get her saddle. Let's ride this gal around a little bit. <gasps> oh, look, we have medium poops to do poop roulette with now. Oh, I wonder if we get different things. Dun dun dun! What do we get? Oh no, we just get the same thing. So far, we only got worms. Oh, <gasps> what do I have in my inventory? I got gold coins and silver coins. Whoa! There must have been some like server. Something something's going on because I have silver coins and gold coins in my inventory that I didn't have yesterday when I logged out. Uh. Okay. I'm gonna put those away. I'm not, I'm not even mad about it. I'm quite happy. Let's put that in there. And that in there. Oh man, we're rich. Did we put our saddle in heel? We did. Okay. It's our first rideable dino on the server. Let's see. Oh my gosh. I feel like we just made a... Ah, oh, I feel like we just won the lottery. Let's pump some movement speed. We're going to need to be able to run away from a lot of stuff, I feel like. I think that's going to be it for today's episode, um, since it took so long to raise this gal. But um, I'm going to work on... What, what should I work on in between episodes? Maybe just collecting some stuff and leveling the Parasaur? And then maybe in the next episode we will uh, go on a little bit of an adventure. We'll, we'll first, um, we'll, we'll think of a name between now and then, and you guys write it in the comment section below, and then we'll name her, and then we'll go on an adventure in the next episode. And we'll go exploring for maybe some new resources. Um, we need to find some salt closer by than the mountain way over there that I went to earlier. And we need to find some sulfur, which I have yet to find on this map. And we need to find... I think there's a resource called limestone that we need to find. So we have to find all those resources. And hopefully now that we have our amazing parasaur, it'll be a lot easier to go exploring. But that's going to be it for today's episode. If you enjoyed, please hit that like button with those dependable thumbs. And subscribe to join the tribe. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.